Now it's time to press buttons and talk with Mickey and Rosie D. Hey, we're bored and frustrated with this case, so for this episode, so the end of the case, we're just gonna swap Phoenix and Francisca. I'm gonna fun. be Francisca, he's gonna be Phoenix. Yeah, I wanna be Phoenix, I'm Miss he Phoenix. I've never heard of them smiling. However... Lions sneeze. <laughs> Lions love to sneeze. That made him happy. Leon didn't plan on biting bad at all. In reality, all he actually did was sneeze. Ooh. And then he got all pixely and red. And he painted the screen red. Lions love to paint and sneeze. He sneezed because of all the pepper spread on the scarf. Oh, what? And the sun got in his eyes in a you weird way. You fool! Wow. You fool! You fool! Don't make fun I'm of me. I'm Francisco von Karma. I'm, I'm so, so pretty. pretty. But I am pretty. You've got to be kidding me. Objection. I got nothing. <laughs> What's the matter, <laughs> Ms. Von Karma? You have to say something when you object. I, I, I object for objection's sake. <laughs> Mr. Phoenix Wright, you, the theory, you believe it? Ciao. You really plan to say this joke of an accident actually happened? Of course I do. It's the truth, maybe. I hope so. I mean, shit, you've gotten along with it so far. The lion may have sneezed due to the pepper, and that's when Bat lost consciousness. Acro nearly lost his brother due to this accident. Or this joke, as you put it, inappropriately. Which is why he tried to get his revenge against Regina. You foolish idiot. It's not a fool. Stop. Come you on. stupid moron. Hmm. So it's a joke of an accident to you, huh? Once again, I'm impressed by your imagination, Mr. Wright. <laughs> to, to think that there's... Is that fun to do? <laughs> yeah, I know. Every time... <gasps> Games do that shit all the time. It's just like, it's what else gasp, can it be? Right? Yeah. To think that there's someone who treats this accident with the respect it deserves. Are you telling me that what I said was true? Really? <laughs> Good! God damn, I made up a lot of shit. A Acro. You don't mean... You can't mean... Fitness. Uh, are you confirming the defense's claim? Mr. Wright. Unfortunately, your imagination is... Not enough to find me guilty of murder. What do you mean by that? The pepper. The scarf. The lion. With these three elements combined. I... <laughs> Captain, <laughs> lion. Captain... Lion... Captain lion Circus. friend. <laughs> Captain Cowardly Lion. Yeah. Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Why'd you suck I gotta sneeze. What, I gotta, what, I gotta protect the planet or something? Oh, gee, I see where you're going, but it's a bit hard to swallow. Not to mention the fact that there's an even bigger problem with your theory. What would that problem be? The same problem it's always been. Evidence. If I dropped Max's bust on top of the Ringmaster... Where is the evidence that proves that claim? Are we gonna present the hat again? <laughs> uh, yeah, take that care. hurts a lot, take actually. Mm -hmm. You mean the conclusive evidence? The biggest problem is the murder weapon, or the lack thereof, to be more precise. Murder weapon? The bus that the defense claims was used. If that were to be found in Acro's room, and if it was covered with the victim's blood, that would be the uh, that would be awfully conclusive in my eyes. That would be the awfully conclusive. Yes, it would be. Hmm. 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 Oh, there it is. Shit, oh, it's not in his it's room. Right, it's that's big. <laughs> God, Holy shit. how did it get here? That should have crushed him like a bug. Well, this sucks because it kind of disproves my case. <laughs> the bus. That monkey's strong. Nick, that bus is huge. You've got to do something. This is the last step. If I get this one right, the case is won. See how things work out. It's just... It's uh, not in the room. See what? See how things work out. Oh, okay. It's Wait, not really? It's not in his room. Oh, uh, okay. It might be worthwhile to search Acro's room, but... Well, why aren't you going to search his room? It looks like you finally figured things out, didn't you? Now you know the true meaning of Von Karma Total Justice. I've never heard that term before, so not really. I guess. I figured with you that's the least I should expect. 
you'd leave no stone unturned. Ow. Of course not. A von Karma never leaves anything to chance. Oh, I'm leaning a little bit. We already searched Ac Do you need first aid? Yes. Okay. Actually, I... Gumshoe. Oh, he's a Band-Aid pal. Neosporin Thank you, too. Gumshoe. Thank, thank you. Oh, it's a My Little Pony Band-Aid. Rainbow Dash, my favorite. We are... <laughs> we already searched Acro's room yesterday. What, what did you find? There's no reason to even say it. If we found what you think we found in that room, Acro would not be here as a witness. But to put a point on it, Max's bust was not in the room. The murder weapon is still unaccounted for. You see, Mr. Wright? The bust wasn't in my room. Furthermore, Detective Dick Gumshoe executed the search by complete surprise. Surprise! Search and time! Surprise! Here we go. Just I'm jumps good. in with a flashlight. And there's a tuba! And there's the bed! Okay, I'm done. And, and we <laughs> took it. It looked very hot. It and, took him two seconds. I told him to go back in. <laughs> and then I was like, okay. <laughs> and then I did, it's like five hour search. You're all right. And we took Acro directly to the prosecutor's office after that. Da, 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 da. Da, da, da. End of story. J just wait a second. Something's funny about all this. <laughs> It looks like the coup de gras in this case was ever so sweet. The coup de grace. Coup de grace. But, but, what about the scarf? What about the note? What about them? Mr. Wright, no offense, but the important evidence here, get out of here, birds, is about the death of the ringmaster. I think you should remember that. Ah! Do something, Nick. Don't let this case slip away. The bust! Where is it now? Hmm. Where's the bust right now? Oh god, I know what they're doing. Mm, yep. You're Phoenix Wright. You know where the bust is. I'm sure you do. There's not even a single clue. How am I supposed to know where the bust is? I, I, I don't know. I guess I lose. It seems as if this case is coming to a close. Well, good thing Von Karma threw away the bust and now it's impossible to prove. The defense's counter-arguments look to have fallen short. Ta 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 ta. Thank you for your support. I didn't support you. Ack! Chocolate, as my hero chocolate, Kathy would chocolate. say. Chocolate! Now if you'll please... You read Kathy too? That's my favorite. Now if you'll please excuse me, Mr. Wright. I think that brings to an end of the cross-examination of this witness. Hold! 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 Oh. Who's saying it? Hold, Hold it, Maya! Yeah. yeah. Where is Max's bust? Probably on his chest, I hope. The defense needs time to prepare to present its lace. I mean case. Sorry, I'm a bit nervous and I just bit my I tongue. Like I don't know how I confused a C for an L. That's a pretty bad mistake to make. But, you know, wacky Maya. I think it's because of bust. Oh. What? What? Oh, wait, shit. We need time to do what? Ow! Why are you the most surprised person here? She's your aide, isn't she? Do you really have a case to present, Mr. Wright? God, no! What? Is he talking to me? The rest is up to you, Nick. I don't what have not? anything! I what are you talking about? God, this would be funny, and God it is. Hey, wait. You can't be serious. Acrobats always have their lives on the lines, don't they? That's how Acro's lived his life up until now. Now it's time for us to walk across our own tightrope. Get up there, Nick. If we don't, we're certain to lose. There's the music. You gotta go up there. You gotta go up there. Up there. <laughs> I don't up wanna there. go up there. Up I'm there. gonna fall. Alright, I hope I don't fall. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! Hold on. Uh, I got an hour recess for I got another band aid for you. Get here. the first aid team in here. Very well. You're the defense gonna need, may proceed. I'm gonna need a lot of band aids this time. He doesn't have a clue. And I don't think he'll be finding one anytime soon. Walking the tightrope of logic, there's no room for a false step as we just demonstrated. Now my arms are broken. Sink or swim, the only way through is forward. What chow? The murder weapon. Where is Max's boss now? It's somewhere in this courtroom. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I've got I hope he's right, because <laughs> it's going to be a real shit show if he's wrong about this. It's obvious. The bust is inside this very courtroom. It's uh, obvious. Allow me to pinpoint the location of the bust once and for all. 
It's mm. gonna be a real controversial if this is uh... Yeah, otherwise I'm gonna look like a real dickhead <laughs> if this is not true. Okay. Acro. I'm really sorry to ask this, and I hope to Christ I'm correct, but do you mind if I take a blanket off your wheelchair? I'm sorry, I didn't quite hear you, Mr. Wright. Well, you are a big guy, and you have a pretty big wheelchair because of it. I just wanted to make sure you weren't hiding anything under that blanket. Because it seems to me that it'd be really easy to hide, say, a bust under there. <laughs> Once again, your penchant for humor hits me where it hurts, Mr. Wright. I think it's pretty amazing that you could laugh in your position. However, your lightheartedness doesn't change the fact that the bust is under there. We all know that you couldn't leave the lodging house by yourself in your condition. That proved inconvenient when Ms. Von Karma happened to search your room yesterday. If she had found the murder weapon in your room, it would have been all over. Which is why you had to hide it. In the only place that you could hide it. Under your wheelchair. Why wouldn't you get rid of it earlier? And why would you keep it around? Yeah, just... I guess there's nowhere for him to stash it, so I he guess, just shoved it under there. Which is why, Acro, I have to ask you again. Could you please remove the blanket from the wheelchair? Well done, Mr. Wright. Masterfully played. Ow. Why? I'm... You! You fool! How could you? Foolish fool! That desk is expensive. Stop. You've got me. I've been bagged by a real pro. Actually, two of them. Two of them? Miss Francisca Von Karma and Mr. Phoenix Wright. What? There's just one thing I'd like to know. How did you know to launch that surprise search on my room last night? Gumshoe scared the shit out of me. Surprise! Hmm? Yeah, he said that. There were two pieces of decisive evidence. The cloak and the bust. I burned the cloak in my room and threw the ashes away with the trash. Regina always took my trash out every morning, you know. But the bust? Obviously, I couldn't throw that away. When you executed your search, all I could do was try to hide the bust. And the only place that I could hide it quickly was under this wheelchair. Ms. Von Karma, you had things all figured out, didn't you? I was completely sucked in by your calculated strategy. And now to be caught in the middle of court hiding the murder weapon. There's no way I can escape that. So you've got me. Well done, Mr. Fe Mr. Wright. Well done, Ms. Von Karma. Hmm. It all makes sense now. I can't believe that Von Karma thought that far ahead. It's amazing. Uh-huh. You definitely couldn't tell by looking at her. She does look like a dummy. I know for sure, I know I couldn't. I can't believe it. I failed. Why did I order a surprise search of your room? If only I hadn't done that. Oh, come on, it was fun. It doesn't matter now, though. It seems as if we've arrived at the truth. Acro? Yes, Your Honor. Did you kill the ringmaster of the Berry Big Circus, Mr. Russell Berry? Yes, Your Honor. I'm responsible for that crime. Acro? All my brother did was want Regina to like him. That's why he'd tease her. One day my brother sprinkled some pepper on Regina. She started sneezing so hard you couldn't help yourself from laughing. That's why Regina thought it'd be funny to get him back in the same way. And that's why she covered the scarf in pepper. I know she didn't want anything bad to happen. I know this. She just wanted to make my brother sneeze a few times too. But 
I just couldn't forgive her. No matter what. What am I truly guilty of? I'm guilty of never ever being able to understand her. Your brother became a star. Regina believed in that so purely that she would laugh innocently when saying it. Too innocently. I just couldn't stand it. No matter how hard I tried. That's when you decided to do something about Regina. Yeah, kill a 16-year-old girl. Yeah. What do you mean by that? So are you saying that you are a victim in all of this as well? No. That's not what I mean. I'm nothing but a murderer. That's who I am. At first I thought I'd kill myself. Then I pondered giving myself up. But I couldn't just up and leave. I just couldn't. That's why I tried to pin this on Max. Max, I'm so sorry. I just... I just... I just couldn't up and leave yet. There's foam coming out of my eyes, guys. Can someone, like, address... Can I get, like, a tissue? This has been such a strange, <laughs> very strange case. It's almost a reflection of the circus itself. It, yeah. The circus is fun, <laughs> at least. If I hate the circus, yeah. I'm an idiot. All right. We finally come to... I can't believe it. You beat me. Again. I'm pretty good. I believe this case is now beyond any point of possible discussion. Thus, I'd like to declare my verdict. Don't really need to, but not yeah. guilty. Hooray! Ah, it's finally over! So when are we getting those hats? Yeah, I and the birds. More. This court is adjourned. I want the bluebird. He's violent. I like that. And a bird. Can we all have bluebirds who are, that are violent players? There's only one bluebird. Fuck! <laughs> Fabulous! But to be honest, I can't really be too happy about this. Acro, the ringmaster, Regina, and Bat. Not a single one of them was a bad person inside, huh? That's a good question, and one I don't know the answer to. Congratulations! Congratulations, Mr. Max! D thank you. What's with the vibe in this room? It's like you guys don't like me or something. We're just thinking about Acro. No, 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 no. If you worry about people too much, then you'll never, you'll be like this forever and never be happy. Huh? <laughs> She's been like this for a while now. <laughs> it's all my fault. <laughs> savory, savory pie. Regina? Mr. Wright, tell me something. Well, what do you want to know, Regina? Acro said something right at the end. I just couldn't up and leave yet. <laughs> Does that mean that Acro... Is he gonna try and get his revenge on me? Oh yeah. Of course he <laughs> never go to sleep. <laughs> you know, I'm kinda done with this no, kid. No, no. Alright. He's not gonna do that to you, Regina. Are you sure? You're really sure? I can believe that? Yep. Acro doesn't have any desire for revenge anymore. If that's true, then I wanna see some evidence. Huh? Acro said that all the time. Wait. Acro said that all the time to you, so I thought it would work for me, too. Uh. Uh. What is this? We go back to the thing. Um. Acro said all the time that. Uh, How do we know that Acro's uh, not going to get his revenge on her? It's because. The alarm. It's because, uh. Bat. Monkey. Oh, uh. Oh, because oh, Bat loved her. Maybe. Uh, kind of. I mean, yeah, but... Acro didn't want to get caught for a reason. He wanted to see his brother open his eyes again. But that... I don't think I got this right when I played, the yeah. first, played it the first time. That's right, Regina. He's still alive, you know. He is, huh? 
But now that Akro's been caught... Uh-huh. I know! What? I'll do it! I'll stay next to Bat as long as it takes! Until he opens his eyes, and then until we can meet Akro again! That's so sweet of you, Regina. I'm sorry, Akro. I'm sorry, Bat. Well, hopefully this is enough to give her a little peace of mind. No. And I hopefully these characters never, ever hey. come back. Hey, Max. <laughs> <laughs> what, what is it, Max? You want to do some... Uh, you want some weed? <laughs> <laughs> you want to light up in the back after all this? We really put you through a lot, didn't we, buddy? I'm sorry about what happened. So, whenever you'd like to leave us, I'll pay your fee and rip up the contract. I understand. Such a fabulous thing to do for me. I might even leave tomorrow. What's going to happen to the circus now? Ah, uh, that's the big question. I hope it burns to the ground. Uh, it's probably gonna burn to the ground. Our ringmaster was really an amazing person, wasn't he? <gasps> <laughs> yeah, I mean, he was. I don't know, I don't know what your problem is. Even though he's not here anymore, everyone is sticking together and holding hands and shit. The staff, the performers, no one wants to leave the circus. That's why I've made a decision. What is it? I've decided that I will take over as the new ringmaster. I'll turn this circus into the best circus the world has ever seen. The best circus the world has ever seen? D, D don't laugh. Amazing. Yay, I can't wait to see it crash and burn. Then I guess that changes things. Huh? There's only one thing the best circus the world has ever seen needs. The world's best illusions. Which means this circus needs the best magician the world has ever seen. Chris Angel, yeah, we can get him, well, I think. Fuck that guy. Oh, Max. Let's work together and make our circus super fabulous. What do you say, big guy? You're not very good. I mean, I don't know what to say. All I can say is thank you. Is no. <laughs> um, <laughs> Regina, you're gonna help them out too, aren't you? No. Um, I don't know. Maybe the circus would be better off without me. What are you talking about, Regina? Why do you think that I brought you to court today? Uh, for fun? We've got to work together to make the very big circus bigger than it's ever been. No. No's right, Savory Pie. It can't be the very big circus without Regina Berry. N Max. Nick. It seems like everything is going to turn out all right here. I, I can't, don't care. I can't wait to go see the best circus the world has ever seen, or it'll be the worst. Either way, it'll be worth it. We'll save you the most fabulous seats. It'll take us a while to get ready, but I'm gonna order special whoopee cushion seats. <laughs> I think I'm actually dying this time. And so oh. Lawrence oh. Mo Curls oh my passed God. away. My heart's not beating. Just leave him. I see. What made the cares? Just like you thought. Yesterday's oh, church <laughs> really is. paid off, sir. Um, you had it all figured out yesterday, didn't you? It was just. I'm. I'm. I'm until we it see. It was just if a thing. Ergo really was the killer. I thought this was the only way it could end. Maybe he's using like a voice modulator, so it's off. Especially if he was a defense attorney. You mean Mr. Right? <gasps> it's now, the airplane! Now it's an, I love airplane! Of course. Well, detective, my plane is about to leave. In other words, I am about to leave. Do me a favor and try not to be too harsh on Acro. Once I get back, I'll make a stop by the chief prosecutor's uh... office. Yes, sir. I'll be waiting for you. Goodbye, Miss Edgeworth. He's alive. Goodbye. Uh, Gun shoot. Nice, oh, Francisca. Cool. Nice coat. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, it's over. Fuck that case. Oh my god, I hate Everything that Everything about it is bad. God damn it. Holy shit. Why is oh, it so bad? Shit. And then this like really fucking good one okay. after it. Very well my turnabout This is, one's real good. This is my favorite case of the whole series. Damn. Uh, it's a really amazing case. Yeah, so, it's incredible. Uh, the whiplash here. I guess just like the first game, the third case just has to be shit. Uh, but let's go back. Oh, Francisco. Oh, yeah, Francisco. Oh, next to me. Uh, <laughs> Hello, Savory. 
Um, just but, those two. Yeah. <laughs> what, what are the other ones like? <laughs> I don't know. Go back. Um, well, these... Oh, yeah, oh, it's yeah like Pearl like and Maya. Yeah, okay. they all... They're a little yeah. lackluster compared to yeah. the previous. But anyway... Okay. Cool. Uh, next time next we're gonna time play. Gonna well, I'm gonna turn okay, about. this case is great. It's good. Uh, it's exciting. So you made it through the worst. This is probably the the low point of the entire franchise. Yeah. Uh, this is kind of universally agreed upon to be the shittiest case in the whole series. Yeah. And I was kind of like going into it, you know, maybe I remembered it poorly, but God Almighty, every, like everything about that. It's a real it's just a wreck. fuck. It's just a train wreck. But we're done. Next time, it's, it's over. gonna be dope. It's over. Thank God. Oh, it's over. It's over.